What's going on everyone? It's nothing but cardboard and today we have a popular video. We have nine cards that were previously graded by another grading company, but now we have them graded by PSA. So stay tuned and see if we have success with this cracking video as we have had it in the past. All right, guys, so this is a big submission for us. We did sneak this one in under the $15 submission rate right at the end of the year, just got these in there. So in this submission, we have nine cracked cards. I'm gonna go ahead and throw it on the screen here. As you can see, we had five cards that were originally SGC. Um, four of them were nine five, one was a 10. I have one PSA card that I cracked resubmitted. I have two HGA nines that I cracked and submitted because I thought they had a good chance of gymming out. And then I had one CSG green label 9.5, which hopefully crosses over to a 10. So uh, lots of big cards. I know you guys were really requesting that we get some better cards. This was our attempt to do that. It is close to baseball season. So um, the first four cards are going to be baseball. All of my cards are going to be football. Um, but these are the four NBC cards. Cody, go ahead and take it away right now. Yeah, so we were actually at Disney, right? When yeah. We bought these cards. We went on a family vacay and we're like, all right guys we need to buy some big cards for our youtube channel because we made it big and uh we bought some guys we have no idea uh about. <laughs> I mean, we, we have a little bit idea no we do we we definitely bought some big names in baseball um and these should be good cards so let us know in the comments what you guys think about these kind of cards and we're we're specifically um targeting sgc nine fives for the yep. nbc cards because we thought hey we can get a nine it'll probably break even a 10 you're making some money here so yeah and we've had such good luck crossing over sgc yep. to psa so nevertheless let's proceed the jordan alvarez this is a rookie autograph and this one is a super sharp card it's actually out of 99 rookie of the year favorites it with is that, an insert with that auto it's an insert but it's still very nice and i believe that is it is an on-card auto so yep. John, what do we pre-grade this bad so, boy? So John and I pre-graded all of these cards, Jim and John and I. You both pre-graded this one a 10, which makes me nervous. Okay, you ready? What do we get? Hey, you got a Jim at nice. 10, that's what I'm talking about. That is huge. That was probably our most expensive card, which is yep. why I'm freaking out a little bit. Um, so we paid a solid, I gotta find it here real quick. Actually, I don't know, do I have the prices on here somewhere? I don't know. Uh, but it's it's over. It's probably about a hundred fifty dollar card for a PSA ten. And we got this for a steal. Actually, I remember we bought this one. Sorry, at a PSA nine, it's a hundred and thirty dollar card. We don't actually know what it's worth at a PSA ten. Yeah, we didn't even play close to a hundred dollars for this one um, when we were at Disney. And the thing is, is everyone sleeps on Jordan. He's such a good hitter, and he's he does so well in the playoffs. Now so. it is an insert, but it's that Moho Refractor on card auto. On card out of ninety nine. Yeah. Woo! That's, so that's a big a card. card. Big card. That's huge, huge win. Yep. Good job, Cody. Thank you. Yep. I did a lot there. <laughs> All right. So the next one is a Vlad Guerrero Jr. Yep. And this one was also the 9.5. So this is a rookie refractor. And Look so that. I pre graded this one a 10. John pre graded this one a 9. Yeah, this one should be interesting. And it got a. Hey, let's go! Oh, Jim Minton. Wow. Beautiful. Card. Oh, that's awesome. So. At a 10, that is a $160 card right there. We got kind of gypped with the surface scratch on this PSA slab. Yeah. That is definitely on the slab itself, but that is a beautiful. Yeah, bat. I want to say we paid like $35 for that card, even in that SGC slab. So SGC is still keeping up with their perfect crossover rate. It's not 100%. Well, but it's I know really, it's not going really to be on the last card, but here we go. This is Ronald Lucunia. Whoa, 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 don't. Don't put that out. Okay, there. I'm not going to put it out there. Debbie Downer over yep. here. What the heck? <laughs> so we have a Ronald Acuna. This is another rookie refractor. Such a nice card. Super nice oh, card. Golly. So John and I agreed on this one, actually. Okay. We both said it was going to be a nine. No. Yeah. Because it's a oh, What? <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's crazy. So at Beautiful. A, at a PSA 10, that's a $250 card. That's so nice. I have no I idea why we gave it a nine, but... It got a 10. So. Another scuffed slab, though. I think we can probably get that out. Yeah. But anyways, PSA. what a beautiful Topps Chrome Refractor card right there. That's even beautiful. Grade. Money. We're three for three right now. All we right. both had that one at a nine. So that's crazy. 
So. All right, so last one, Julio. I'm. Is this the Moho? The. So the, yeah, this is his Moho, his silver. Uh, hold on. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This is silver the, pack. Yep. I got the one. So this one. I pre-graded oh. this one a nine. John pre-graded this one an eight. Well, fellas, there's you got a little something going on there. Maybe that's part of the design. And it got, got a, a nine. nine. So that's good. So John gave it an eight. I gave it a nine. Um, at a PSA nine, that card is still worth a solid one third. <laughs> Guys, that is beautiful. That is beautiful. One Jordan, heck of a Guerrero, return right Acuna. there. Acuna, come on. And today, just so you guys know, it's not going to be the day that we drop this, but today is March 13th, which means we got these in time for baseball season. So just Jeez. ahead of opening season and right in time for the World Classic. So that is huge. all these guys are playing right now for their respective countries. So that's huge. That that was way better than I thought it was going to be, Cody. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, I, thought, I didn't even see these cards after you guys cracked them. I didn't even see these cards when they delivered. <laughs> so these are beautiful. You're I love welcome. Those. Yeah, good job. So I, I honestly thought there was a good chance we got um, a 10, two nines, and an eight on that order. So well, three tens and a nine, I'll take that all day. That's 75%. Well, hopefully this carries over to your personal. Here I know we go. this is NBC, so let's see. Oh, dude. Let me say a prayer real quick. Okay. Lord, please. Touch Amen. All right. Okay, guys, I'm just hoping that my return is half as good as that one is. We'll see. The first one is very interesting. So I got this card. I thought it was perfect. I sent it to PSA once. It got a mint nine. And I was like, screw that. I'm cracking it and sending it back. Just so because this is actually your... I, yeah, I got this off eBay. I've already sent it to PSA once. Oh. I'm rolling the dice, hoping okay. that I get it again. But I know that John and I both pre-graded this one a 10. You pre-graded all your cards at 10, Well, it's because John. I only send 10s, Cody. That's what it is. So that's what the card looks like. It's super nice, and it's making me real nervous looking at this. Because sending it to PSA twice is just generally not a good it's idea. It's just the Trevor Lawrence. And it wasn't a good idea, so I got another 9. It's the Trevor Lawrence effect. They don't like giving 10s to Trevor Lawrence. I think Lawrence. that that's part of what it is, because Trevor Lawrence is just ridiculously hard to gym in yeah. out. So it's still got a 9. It's a $40 um, valuation. still a $40 card, so I've probably spent that much in grading. <laughs> but that's okay. That's all right. You, you got to give it a shot every once in a while. So this one I actually bought as an SGC 10. Mm. Probably paid a little bit more than I should have for this one because I bought it in December before Mac Jones really plummeted. I think that's what I paid. Yeah, you paid about 60 bucks. Okay, after shipping and everything. Yep. So this better get a 10 or else I'm going to lose my butt. But it's nice. a, it's an orange laser prism. And I got a gym in nice. I needed that or else right. I was going to lose some money on that one. You so. just made up the money from the Trevor Lawrence. That one go. recent comp, 90, and he's down right now. Yeah, so, yeah. so that's 90, go I'll at least break even on that one. So yeah. this was an interesting one. So this is a uh, Justin, Justin Herbert. Um, I got it, and it was an HGA nine. I like the subgrades. I felt like mm. it really got. And actually, with their new grading, this would have been a gem mint because now two nine fives and two nines is a nine five. Okay. So this was before they upgraded their um, their scale. Uh, so I don't remember what I paid for this one. You About, paid sixty nine fifty four. Yeah. And Justin Herbert was up when I bought this, unfortunately. But there it is. Oh, that's a cool Super nice phenomenon card. Pre-graded it to 10 because I pre-graded everything at 10. And it got a 9. That sucks. But that hurts a little bit. Yeah. Hurts the pride a little bit. but you That's know. okay. Current comps in offseason, 50 bucks for a 9. So I'm losing a little bit of money. But these were my two big cards that I sent in. All right. Two Jalen Hurts. Two Jalen Hurts. So this is a Ooh. Prism Black Silver. This one was a Gym Mint as well. I actually got a great deal on this one. Is this a silver? Oh, this is a silver. Okay. You so paid 80 bucks for this I one. I paid 80 bucks for a Jim Mint CSG Prism Black Silver, which has just, you know, gone up excrement, uh, just a huge amount. I don't know what word yep. I'm looking for, but it went up a lot. Exponentially. Exponentially. Yep. Here we go. And I got a Jim yeah, Mint 10. There we go. Nice. That, was, that was my most expensive card. And so. you are back in the black, baby. Here we go. Because $340 valuation in off season. Yeah. And so. With that, I have less than $100 into this card, $340 now. So that's going to that's gonna help me a lot, guys. <laughs> yeah. That's going to pay for some of these other duds. Yep. All right. The but last this one. ain't going to be a dud, baby. So we have another HGA9. We have had some uh, we have had some luck with these HGA9s crossing over to PSA 10s, especially when it's for centering. As you can see, great corners and surface, a 9 on edges, 8.5 for centering. And I have to believe... Um, I, I actually put the uh, grading tool on this one afterwards, and it was in tolerance. I mean, it really doesn't look that bad. I mean, it's a it's little a thick, little thick on the right. It wasn't bad on the back either, but 
You want to know how much you paid for this first? Yeah. $56. That's not bad. I think that it actually goes for more raw now than that. Ah! Got a nine. That's okay. That's okay. It's okay. You're breaking even. Most recent comps about 80 bucks. 80 bucks. Okay. So not terrible. This so, is huge. This, this was my, huge. my saving grace right here. I actually yeah, have one more of these. Awesome. And an SGC 10 that I need to crack and resub. But beautiful card. I got two 10s. Uh, not bad. Not as good as NBC did. Um, yeah, you kind of hurt yourself by sending him with that fire over there. Yeah, I think that was part of the problem. But you know, the thing is, SGC has just been so good to us compared yeah. to all of the other companies. So if you look at what I got a yeah, 10 put on. put the labels on there. One of them was uh, SGC 10. Okay. Uh, that one was a 9. So really the 9s that were already 9s just crossed back over to 9s. But now PSA 9s instead of HGA. And then my 9.5 CSG uh, upgraded to a 10. So it was the green label. It was the green label. Yeah. So it was already a gym mint, went to a gym mint. So yeah. I'm actually pretty happy with this. Um, Mac Jones is going to go up as soon as they get him some weapons. They just need to get him some freaking weapons. And then that won't be a $90 card anymore. Yeah, so, this is a hold for now, for yeah. sure. Until yeah. the beginning of the season. 100%. 100%. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys. So that is going to wrap up this cracking crossover um, submission we have right here. Th these cards right here crazy good crazy good so um i can't complain at all that's i think it was overall nasty, success nasty. another good example of where you know you can take these cars from different grading companies send it over to psa and probably net more than you would if you sold it in their current slab at their current grade absolutely and then sgc is just again showing that they are probably the most superior and consistent other grading company and you can use them to send over to PSA and make a absolutely bunch of money. I mean look at this we just made like a hundred dollars a card easy easy all right guys so that's it hope you enjoyed it we'll see you next time